Earth Signs. Welcome to my channel. My name is Day. Um, this is the Butterfly Healing. Today's message for the Butterfly Kisses um, is just going to be all intuitive. Um, after meditating, um, it was just kind of very clear that there were no questions really to be asked. So, hey, I'm just going to take it as it comes. <laughs> so we will pull three cards. Um, I will then ask Spirit to clarify those, those cards using the Psychic Tarot. Um, and then after that, whatever comes out is for you. I'll then pull the butterfly kisses to confirm um, in love what messages may be there for yourself, to your partner, or your partner to you. Take what resonates, leave what doesn't. Don't try to make it fit. You'll only upset yourself even further than you already are or confuse yourself even more. And I normally don't say that, so maybe you're a little upset or confused. Maybe you've been watching some tarot looking for some answers. Um, at the end of the day, you always should go in. Everyone's situation is different. Um, even you and your friends and your circles don't date the same type of people. So um, don't have the same type of relationships. Even if it mirrors, it's still not the same decisions that each person is making. So make sure you only take what resonates and leave everything else. So Taurus, Virgo, and Capricorn. First card, Divine Spirit, Holy Spirit. Second card, Divine Spirit, Holy Spirit. What do we have for the sec second card? Archangel Michael. We usher you into this reading. Thank you. Second card. And one more card regarding lo love. Okay. There it is. Bottom of the deck is adjudication. Maybe I should turn this on light in here. Hmm. Adjudication. <laughs> I don't know if that helped or that harmed. <laughs> uh, next card is community. That might have harmed a little bit, huh? I'll just put a filter on it. Uh, community. Oh, I'm sorry. That was backwards. That was your third card. Your first adjudication, and then there's courthouse. Poverty and community. Okay. Marriage is under adjudication. Ooh, this might get spicy. Mm. Let's get some clarity around these cards. So, in regards to love, spirit, divine spirit, holy spirit, what do we have for the earth signs? Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Thank you. Ooh, nice, clean shuffles. So, hopefully, we'll have a nice, clean read. Let's see. Starting with courthouse. Hmm. Courthouse, divine spirit, holy spirit. Clarify courthouse. What's going on with the courthouse? Okay. Light. This is, this is, okay. Oh, wow, and that's all major arcana. Okay. The light card, the sun card. The patience is your temp is temperance. The will of fortune, destiny, and a tower. New beginnings. This, I, I'm hearing that this is not a real court. This, like, 3D court. This is spiritual court. Someone turned their back on material harvest and chose difficulties which caused um heartache in a union and if you look at this card this person has like this fake wig it looks like this fake uh, mustache it just kind of feels like fake documents like maybe someone i, I heard someone took the law into their own hands like the spiritual law in their own hands. So if there was, I definitely feel like there's someone who knew that this was their union, knew that this was their empress. And I said, I, I wasn't going to do feminine, masculine, but I'm feeling masculine 
was the one who turned their back on what was growing, something that they knew that I'm hearing. You knew you planted seeds, so maybe someone could have been pregnant and was and was turned away from, or y'all were talking about family, you were talking about building a home together, and um, someone did not choose wisely. Someone chose to continue. You know how kids jump in puddles? I don't even know why I'm seeing that right now, but a kid jumping in puddles, like you like to be messy, like somebody, okay, messy. Maybe that's what it is. Somebody likes to be messy. And um, whatever it was, wow, it, 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 what I'm feeling is like the, the transition of events was so uncanny. It was like, oh, that was nothing but God. So if that makes sense, I know that probably doesn't make sense to a lot of people. But all I can say is that this was a spiritual union that someone deliberately turned their back on and um, they ended up going to spiritual court or they will be here shortly. But I'm feeling like um, I'm hearing them um, on top of the world, living on top of the world, top of the world, top of the world. So I feel like the divine feminine is like, that's cool. Yeah, there goes that nine of cups. That's cool. I don't need I, and I'm hearing I don't need your I don't need your truth. I don't need your clarity. I don't need, I don't need none of that. That's what I'm hearing. I don't need none of that. But um, if you've had a situation where someone deliberately left you out, possibly got you pregnant, you thought you were pregnant, something to that nature, that was divine intervention the entire way. There, This is all major arcana. And again, this courthouse is not the 3D courthouse. I heard that's, that's a spiritual courthouse where they decided to smack that gavel because somebody deliberately did something really, really petty. Um, I, don't, I can't say what it is. Everybody's obviously going to be a little different. Um, but moving on to the poverty card. Divine Spirit, Holy Spirit, what do you have for the poverty card? Archangel Michael, we... Okay, we're going to take rifle jumpers around here. Um, okay. <laughs> Jump that, huh? <laughs> positive movement forward <laughs> i have a good time with spirit i don't know why people don't it's such it's just fun i don't know <laughs> you're gonna jump another one um patience and planning okay poverty the waiting game and intuition That's 22. That may be significant. You may see a lot of twos. Seven, eight. So moving forward. So what I, okay, let me just get a few more here. Divine Spirit, Holy Spirit. <laughs> What's that? Ah, there it is. Decided to move away from this devil. This devil, obviously, the devil can give you all the wishes and whims and dreams and things in your world, but then they can also bankrupt you. Steal your soul, take your soul, and take everything else with it. And I'm feeling like someone was like, no, I'm not. I'm not doing that anymore. Um, I'm not going to keep waiting in this cycle with you anymore. I'm going to use my intuition. I'm going to move forward. And I heard that it may have taken this may have taken a couple years. Because this card, if it gets to moving, um, it's either that it depends on how it's moving. But this is like moving. So it may have taken a couple years for you to get out of this cycle. I'm hearing mine six, seven, eight forward movement. Five, six, seven, eight, uh, emotional loss. So yes, there was some heartache and some pain with having to move on. But, and I heard that you may have even moved on and felt like, um, maybe I'm here. Uh, so some of you may have left and left with nothing. Um, say some of you may have felt like you left with nothing. Like this person took everything that you had. Um, they may have taken some of your money. I'm feeling like maybe they also got away with some things, some documents, some money, some property, some, something like that. Um, Go a little bit further on this for me. What's that there? Power. 88. Yeah, you definitely had the power to move on. I don't feel like there's a, a crown chakra at the bottom of the deck. Um, definitely tapping into your higher self. That's 77 right there. But um, definitely the power to move on. You you, you definitely were strong. And But you're, you're talking about earth signs here. Whatever had you... Um, 
may have even brought out some of your devil side, some of your narcissism. I'm hearing, I'm hearing fighting, arguing, bickering. I'm hearing um, childish style behavior. I, you text me 10 minutes, I text you 11 minutes. It might have brought some of that childish behavior out of you. Um, I'm hearing um, put some put, her, put some age on them too. Put some age on them, something like that. Like you might not, you you weren't as fiery as you used to be. You weren't as bite back as you used to be. You weren't as willing to do the tug of war like before I'm hearing and that really helped you just break away from this poverty mindset that this was all you're going to have or this is the only way that relationships can go or something to that nature I hear you don't know where you're going but you don't care it's not here is what I heard and so if you feel like you may have poverty or you may feel like you're in poverty with love right now it is time for you to move forward um and as an earth sign I can understand that sometimes if it's like the devil got the devil it's like oh well then I mean you got me before I get you type of thing I don't know where that came from. Um, and it caused someone some, some emotional heartache, but that's okay because it's time f- from forward movement. But I feel like you really know that. And you're getting a lot of synchronicities. Again, 22, 88, and then you have 5, 6, and 7. So the poverty feeling, whatever they took, um, honestly didn't take much. Um, because, the, again, going back to the original message that we started with, they are um, being held in the spiritual court system. So... Just keep on doing what you're doing, stepping back into your power. I heard don't act like you're you're not old. It didn't take years off of your life. It may have it just taught you a lot of lessons. It didn't take years off of your life if you're asking. Okay, so let's get into the community card. Okay, leave them. All right. Community is the next card. Let's get some clarity around this. 